In this video we will explore how we can use design variants to create assembly documents. Once variants have been created and configured using the variant manager, we can make use of Altium Designer's draftsman feature to create scalable assembly drawings. One of the ways to add a draftsman document to the project is using the right mouse click context menu. In this case we will use a default template to create a new document. In the draftsman document it is possible using the properties panel to control various drawing options such as grids. Also from the properties panel under the general tab we can select the different variants and if required define the scale of the assembly view prior to placing it. After placing the assembly view as we can see one of the components is shown as hatched. This indicates in this variant it is an outfitted component. From the properties panel it is possible to change the color and mesh display style. Or if we decide we can even hide the non-fitted component. If required the assembly variant of the document can be changed by selecting it from the properties panel. And if alternative components have been used in any of the variants these will also be displayed in the assembly views. It's also possible to place multiple views of different variants on the same sheet. For example we'll copy and place another view of the PCB. Now let's select the newly placed view to see its properties in the properties panel and choose another variant for this view. It's worth making a note choosing a different source variant in the properties panel for the document will not affect the newly placed assembly view. You can return to the ability to automatically synchronize the views by selecting the document option from the variation tab in the properties panel. 